so i hope you understood what is bim actually but to describe that in 2 minutes is not enough so in upcoming videos we will discuss so now let's see still what are the questions uh, we have so i think it is about positions in bim so generally whenever we start a career in maybe any discipline we should be knowing the ultimate positions okay if we know the positions then there will be a growth for our career so if you talk about positions in bim industry so we have in general three positions one is bim modeler that is at the lowest level then we have bim coordinator and again then we have the bim manager okay but to start the career with bim maybe you need to go for bim modeler but again it depends upon the engineer and architect because for architect we have bim architect and again for engineer we have bim engineer but for general we have bim modeler but and all of these roles are same okay so in general that is why if i say we have bim modeler bim coordinator and bim manager but apart from this we have other positions such as bim lead then maybe we can call it as bim specialist then we have bim technician okay bim directors vdc specialist vdc engineer vdc manager okay maybe some automation specialist okay some application development specialist some add-ins uh, like developers so we have lot of positions available in the industry okay so in general we have these three positions so maybe if you are a fresher you can start with bim modeler okay then you can go with after 2 to 4 years of experience maybe because some companies will <coughs> ask for maybe at least 2 years of experience some companies will ask for 3 to 4 and 5 years and some companies will ask for 10 years of experience for a bim coordinator okay then maybe after 4 years you can go for bim coordinator then after maybe one or two years you can switch for bim manager so you should have a goal when you are entering into any career to grow your like professional and personal things okay